Hey everybody, this is Kleiner Gamer here and I'm here with a new part of Let's Play Spider 3 Reignited. I know it's been a while, but I'm back again and this time uh, you're able to see me a lot better. Because I've got a ring light uh, on my music stand just to my left and it's uh, making me uh, making the face cam a lot better. So you're able to see me a lot better, especially in night time. So um, I'm really happy that I invested that purchase into the ring light. So anyway, in today's part we're going to be heading into... Uh, the next uh, Sparks level. I've located another lost egg. If Sparks is up to it, he can try to rescue it from Spider Town. Spider Town. All right. Well, let's go then. Let's enter Spider Town. What could possibly go wrong? I'm not afraid of spiders, luckily. So this level will not give me any. Uh, it will not give me any uh, any um, flashbacks. <laughs> I mean, spiders are okay, to be honest with you, but they're not, like, that scary, in my opinion. Right, let me see if I can remember the controls here. So, I believe squares to charge, circles to fire, and what's the X button doesn't do anything. R2 fires as well. Right, okay. Sorry about that. It's been a while since I've played these levels, so just trying to remind myself of uh, what the controls are again. All right. I think I've got that there. So that gets rid of the electric barrier there. Oh god. Mm, these spiders might be a little bit of a nuisance. Oh, of course, I keep forgetting square buttons to charge. What I get for not playing this game for such a long time. <laughs> Alright, now you find the next key here. Come on, get rid of all these spiders. Oh, they're all. That's interesting, they're coming from flowers. You, you would expect, like, maybe a killer bee type. Oh, jeez. Oh, god. You'd expect, like, maybe, like, killer bees to fly out of there, or maybe wasps to fly out of there, since they're quite deadly. But no, they're spiders for some reason. Maybe in the spider universe, maybe uh, spiders might like pollen, who knows? Okay, I'll need to try and find the lower the defences here for this. This is going to be a lot more tougher than I anticipated this level. Oh my god. Ah, let's play ring around the, the flower. Ring around the rosy with spiders. Nothing more, nothing wrong with that at all. Oh, good god. Oh, there we go, that takes care of the big spider there. Alright, I'm going to get rid of this flower coming up here, so I can stop more of these spiders coming out. Alright, I need that butterfly. Good, I'm back to full health. Right, I need another key here. No, you don't. Okay. Never been a big fan of spiders, especially ones that shoot out uh, lasers. I mean, I don't mind them, I'm just not particularly a huge fan of them. I'm not, I'm not afraid of them, I'm just not particularly a huge fan of them, to be honest with you. Okay, right, since I've got that key, would I be able to use that to disable that force field there? No. Can I use it to disable this, though? Yeah, I can. Sweet. So there should be another key here. Oh my god, okay, right, get rid of these two first. Alright, nice. Okay, get that key next. Ah! Okay, that actually gets rid of that electric uh, force field there surrounding that flower. Oh, for goodness sake. Oh my god, I'm almost dead. I am almost dead. I need to be very careful here. 
Okay, why were those spiders not firing at me? Were they feeling sorry for me or something? They must have felt really bad for me. <laughs> They're thinking, oh god, he's having such a bad time, let's spare his life. Very kind of you, spiders. Does that restore my health, actually? Oh no, it doesn't, okay. Hmm, how do you fight the- oh yes, X to fire the special weapons, okay. Another oh god damn it. I had a feeling that was gonna happen there. Okay, I think I reached a checkpoint, didn't I? I'm sure I did. Yeah, I did reach a checkpoint, sweet. Alright, get past that electric barrier. See I told you, those spiders. Okay, maybe I wasn't standing in the correct position for them to fire at me. Oh yeah, fair enough. I honestly thought that those spiders were feeling sorry for me. I thought they had an ounce of sympathy for me. And I thought I would be thinking to myself, really? Enemies in Spyro having sympathy? That is, that is definitely something new. These spiders as much as possible. Oh, now they're following my every movement. But at least they're not like the, the spiders in the, the Forbidden Forest. <laughs> Alright, so that opens up another door. Let's find out what that is. Ah, oh, good god, where did you come from? Alright. Alright, nice. Okay. Let's take care of these last few of that last rocket. And go down here. Oh my god, okay. Oh, good god. Oh my god. There's way too many of these. Oh my. No, oh my god, yeah, I rushed right in the danger there when I shouldn't have. <sighs> oh, god, what have I done? Have I put myself in a very bad situation here? I think I have. I guess that's what I get for rushing too much. Right, let's um, take this a step at a time. Right, so that takes care of that. Get rid of him. Oh, I know, I've already been that way, haven't I? Right, okay. Go down then. Okay, there was a- wait, there was a ton of enemies there. Alright, I have to wait for him to start spinning around. There we go. This level is a little bit more challenging than I thought it was going to be. I thought this level would have been quite simple, but it's actually proven to be a challenge. Now, unlike last time, unlike the last Sparks level that I did, I'm going to try and get all these gems before I defeat the boss. So, is there another one? Yes. Good. Well, I got all the gems. Sweet. So, I'm not going to make that mistake again like I made last time. Yeah, so you have to defeat the spiders that he sends out here before they can- Oh my- Jesus. Okay, not good, not good, not good. Just create some space. Oh my god! I wasn't expecting them to send in more spiders after me. <gasps> god damn it. Why is this boss so hard? I mean, it's not... I don't think it's that hard, to be fair. I mean, I'm just not having a good time with it. 
Maybe I should have saved the rockets for this guy. For this big fella here. Oh my god! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, this is way too close. You know, maybe I'm better off with the analog on this. Try using the. I think I'm using the analog stick. Uh, so I'm using the directional buttons and the analog stick. Maybe the analog might be able to help me here. A lot more beneficial. Yeah, if I stick in the middle between those spiders, I should be able to get a good pattern on them here. Yeah, like that. Like I said, I got hit one time, but at least it's working out well. My god, right, okay, I had to make a choice there. I knew that I was going to get hit there, but I was thinking, okay, right, which is the lesser of two evils? Getting hit by the mini- oh my god! Getting hit by the mini spiders or getting hit by the giant spider? Probably best not to get hit by the giant spider. Oh my Jesus. Come on. Oh, for fuck's sake. Why is this boss giving me such a hard time? Don't understand it. This shouldn't be that hard, this. Honestly, it feels like the bosses in the Sparks games are a lot harder than the actual bosses you face as Spyro. Which is very weird, in my opinion. But no, like, when I'm playing these Sparks levels, as I mentioned before, it reminds me of the Space Invaders uh, minigame. Er, not minigame, sorry, the Space Invaders game. That I played a long time ago on the uh, the Game Boy Color. As a matter of fact, during my absence, actually, I don't know if I talked about this, but the the Game Boy Advance and Game Boy Color or Game Boy emulator is now available on the Switch, and I downloaded those, uh, of course. Yeah, I know I died to the boss, but I might as well talk about something while I'm suffering on this. And I um, I downloaded those um, emulators, and they brought back some uh, brought back some very good memories of playing certain games on there. Unfortunately, a lot of the games on the Game Boy uh, emulator I never really played. Like, for example, Super Mario Land 2, the six golden coins. Never really played that one, and oh my god. I thought that that giant spider was homing in on me. But, uh, I remember playing the original Space Invaders on the Game Boy Color before. That was funnily enough published by Activision as well. Jesus, okay, I can't afford to keep taking the more hits here, Jesus Christ. It's a good thing, actually, I've just noticed this, I think the spider can actually, oh my god. Yeah, I'm gonna die again, aren't I? Yeah, try luring that spider to killing his own guys. That's one thing I actually noticed that I should have taken advantage of. Oh, come on, you're so close. Right. I have him keep chasing me down. Right, there should be one left here then. Good. Thank goodness for that. And I got Tootie. Web be gone. Nice. Right, let's make sure that's level 100% done. So, let's leave then. So unlike last time, I actually managed to beat that level 100% without having to go back into it again to get a single gem. <laughs> oh, thank goodness I didn't make that mistake again because that spider boss was really annoying. I have to say, I think that level as a whole actually was kind of annoying. It wasn't... Uh, oh, all I can say is uh, that it wasn't very friendly. And I certainly wasn't welcome in the neighborhood either. Yeah, okay, right, yeah, en enough. <laughs> Corny Spider-Man jokes, of course. It's certainly friendly and there certainly isn't something you want to be in the neighborhood. Yeah, of course. Right, anyway, 
with that being said, I think I'm going to end this part off. I know it's a bit short, this one, but as I mentioned in my update video, I want this to be like a double bill of episodes and I don't want to make this one too long. So I'm going to head back to the home world over here. Oh, I could have just dropped down there. All right, I am going to go to Evening Lake again. And uh, the next time I come back, I will be going into the second world, or sorry, the second level of the Evening Lake world, which I can't quite remember. As a matter of fact, I don't know which one I'm going to go to, so I'm going to have a little ex exploring around and uh, see uh, which level I particularly fancy going to in the next part. Seems to be a very, very long time to take here to travel between worlds. If only there was such a thing as fast travel in these remakes. <laughs> if only there was such a thing as a fast travel, it would have been a lot better. So anyway, managed to do that 100% the home world there. So, I could climb up and see what... Is there a level up here actually? I can't remember. Uh, there is, but it's a Sparks one, right? I can't do that one yet, because I have to beat everything else first. Now, I went up there before to Bentley's homeworld, or Bentley's level there. So I think next time I come back, I'm going to visit the Frozen Altars next time. So anyway, I want to thank you all very much for watching this part. Feel free to like if you enjoyed, comment down below as well for your thoughts. And uh, feel free to hit the subscribe button as well for more content coming up in the future. Till then everyone, this is Kleine Gamer here signing off and I will see you again next time for more videos coming up in the future. And I will try my best to stay active as much as I can and I will let you know if anything does happen in the future. Sorry, it's just I don't know why I have a bad habit of doing that. But anyway, um, I'll see you again soon enough. Till then folks, take care and I'll see you soon. Bye bye.